Okay, so we're gonna do this. We gotta figure out who we're taking. Alright, sit down on the tree. Let's figure this out. Notes. Arkansas. That guy is holed up in the minefield. From what they told me, his only crime is taking those bastards out. Sounds like a saint, if you ask me. Susan Lancaster. Tenpenny Tower used to be one of them. Flack also used to be one of them. Red, the dock at Big Town, made deal with them. Went bad. None of these people sound horrible. Maybe these two? Lancaster and Flack? They used to be slavers, or attached to them in some way. But the fact that they left means they probably don't want to be that anymore. <sighs> Doc. I know nothing about this Doc. Maybe they were just trying to make deals to survive. Maybe they weren't. <sighs> where are they? That looks like where the Doc would be. the minefield. That's the tower and that's Rivet City. <sighs> Those are really far away. Alright, first things first. We'll check out the one close to us. Get more information on this dock. See if they're the one. Otherwise, maybe Flack down here. It's so far away though. No. If I'm going to do this right, I have to accept that I'm not going to get this done today or even tomorrow. It's going to take time. All operations take time. They're slaves, not prisoners. As long as they're useful, they'll stay alive. I know that's harsh, I know that sounds horrible, and I hate saying it, but it's true. If I get myself killed, no one will come to rescue them. They'll just have to hold out. I'll come back as soon as I can. Alright. This direction. Who's that? Ugh. Oh, just scorpions. With very loud... dead. Right, slaver. The very loud footsteps, those tiny animals. Right. So. Try and get your mind off of what you're doing. Focus on the goal. You're not enslaving them. Not permanently. You're just taking one of them, putting an explosive collar around their neck, and sending them to a bunch of monsters. Sometimes, Sean, sometimes you gotta be a monster to save those from monsters. Lesser of two evils. If there was another way. What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh my gosh, those are huge. Let's, uh... Let's back away slowly. I don't think I want to be taking those things on today. So we're going to go this direction. As quietly 
as possible. Oh, great. A cliff. All right. Let's go this way. Head in this direction. What is that? Oh my gosh. So many of them. Just like those monsters from before. To the west. Great. Way too many of them. Gotta go around. Oh crap. There's more of them. Look at that one. Great, they're everywhere. Maybe I could take them out quietly? Not likely. Not all of them. All right, we'll sneak around. Oh, man. Sometimes I think it might be better moving around at night. But the truth is, I have no idea how well they can see in the night. If they can see better than I can, only hurting myself. One of those strange lizards. Some sort of old town. Worth checking out, maybe? Not right now. Got a mission to do. But if I could gather allies, maybe. I can't be the only one that's against these slavers. Friends, allies. But the problem with that is, if there were people out there willing to do something, and with the capability of doing something, why haven't they done so already? Alright. What's that? What was that? Oh crap. Quick and quiet, get away from there. Stay as far away from them as possible. Jeez. So I wonder anyone's still alive in this world. Oh, that's... that's pleasant. That's just... <clears throat> well, let's just leave them, shall we? To their own devices. Should be okay to move a bit faster now. Sort of old factory. Where am I? Getting fairly close. Whoa. 
That thing is huge, and I think it's seen me. Take out the stinger first. See that. No. Good. Oh. Take that. That's probably not edible. Or at least I'm not hungry enough to try it. Check that place out. Could be supplies there. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere. Alright. Like I said, I'm not going to rescue those kids today or tomorrow. And every potential place I search is more weapons, more ammo, more food, more chances to be effective. Perhaps I'll find allies. Or just more information. What the hell is going on? Right, gotta be quiet. That you can always make use of those. Ooh, hello. Railway rifle. Interesting. Oh, I can't figure that out. Alright, well, some interesting things in here. Unfortunately, I don't have the skill to bust through that. Alright. Let's check the main building. Slow and steady. Let's get the pistol out. Rats. Pit boy's picking them up. Gotta be careful. like some sort of security program I'm not familiar with. Take you. Damn it. I have to move quickly. What the... the hell are those? God, this place is crawling with them. Do I have anything to help fight radiation? Radix. Right. Gotta clear this place out. These monsters. If anyone just walks in here, they're gonna be slaughtered. Right. Slow and quiet. One down. 
I think I may have just announced my presence. with this thing. Two down. Try and stay quiet. They don't know exactly where I am. Try and take him out. Got him. Okay. Still not sure where it's coming from. Crap, I gotta get the big one. Crap. Okay. Okay. Alright. Ah! Oh! Oh, I'm covered in this stuff. Ah. Oh. Alright, well. No time for subtlety now. Great, another one. Have a grenade. Crap. Ow. Can't get away from him. He's gonna explode again like the other one. Jeez. On these things, no. Nothing I want. Oh, disgusting. Hello. Let's see here. There we go. Easy peasy. Alright. Anything in these lockers? Looks like they're all empty. A blood pack? Get to use that though. Alright. I gotta hurry. I don't wanna stay in this place too much longer. any of this stuff. It's still generating some sort of power though. Right. Oh my gosh. There's the radioactive material. I gotta be quick. What is this? Some sort of weapon? Let's see here. Alright, let's try and be quick. 
Alright. What do we got? How about painting? One right. So it's not an ING. I think... Four right. So it's the I, right? One, no, 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 no. So the I, it's not an ING. No, so it's not that. So, uh, huh. Seven, right? There's only one left that's not. So, I'm missing one. Supplied. Has to be. There we go. Alright. What do we got here? Disengage lock. I think that opened the safe. Well, not a whole lot there worth taking. Anything else here? No. Let's get out of here. This radiation's gonna start to become a problem soon. At least we cleared the area out. Jeez. Hello? What are my radiation levels like? Not fantastic, but I'll survive. Okay. And just a few bruises from those... whatever they were. Some sort of monster? A ghoul? They look like zombies. Gotta be careful. If this has shown me anything, it's that this world is extremely dangerous. Who's that? It's a person. Wait a second. That's the guy. The sniper. Sniping position. People will generally come in through the road. He's in a perfect shot to hit them. I don't want to kill him, though. But, since we're here... Maybe we can get around. I'm sure that's probably where the minefield is. He might have traps up behind him. If I can get close enough to him to talk... This might be a very bad idea. What are my other choices? There. I'm here. Let's see what we can do. Mesmetro. What's the instruction manual say? 
first, let's congratulate you on choosing the Metrotron as your preferred non-lethal subjugation device. Your field reports will assist us in our research. I'd never even heard of this before I got injured. Help us continue to improve the capabilities. Important, please see your supervisor or commanding officer for details regarding the legal requirements and restrictions before discharging this on civilian summary. The Metrotron is the undisputed leader in the field of non-lethal target elimination and retrieval, simply point, shoot, and subdue. Hot work simply stated, the Mesmertron sends out series, a series of waves that short-circuit key areas of the target's brain, much like a radio signal. Only instead of a radio picking up pleasant music, the target's brain picks up a series of complex and confusing signals that overwhelm the synaptic pathways with erroneous data, turning off important high-level thought centers and voluntary motor control. Class B, extremely efficient classification warning. The Mr. Charles designed as a Class B, extremely experimentally efficient weapon. Experimentally is kind of a big difference from extremely. This means that from time to time, unexpected and potentially embarrassing side effects may be experienced. See your supervisor or commanding officer before using on civilians. Occasional anomalies, effects that have been recorded by field tests against certain targets include increased aggression, the extremely rare resonant brainwave feedback loop, which is usually accompanied by explosive cranial deformation. Please report the appearance of any of the... In other words, sometimes this kills them. Fantastic. Sean, just how far are we willing to take this? What do I do? <sighs> do I try and talk to him? Oh God, Sean, what do you do? 